These are the best fermented dill pickles, and I'm going to show you how to make them. Let's start with the cucumbers. Pickling cucumbers are going to be the best bet for this project, but you can use any small cucumber. Next, it's important that we cut off the blossom end, as this ensures a crunchy pickle. If you don't know which end that is, just snip both ends. I then sort the cucumbers. I'll keep the small ones whole and then cut the large ones into spheres. Any medium ones can be cut in half. Now for the spices. I have garlic, dill, carrots, hot peppers, and mustard seeds. You can add any spices you want, but these are my top five. I then zero a jar on a scale and add my dill and garlic. After that, I stack in my cucumbers and carrots nice and tight and put the hot peppers in wherever they fit. It's important that they are packed tight so they don't rise above the water level. I then multiply the total weight by 0 0.03. This gives me a 3% salt content. After four days, the pickles are ready, but the longer they sit, the more sour they'll get. Move them to the fridge and they'll continue to ferment.